Yes, sir. It's your boy B Hayes. We're back with another one, guys. So before we get into the video, let's get this video a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, go ahead and hit subscribe, turn on the post notifications so you'll be alerted every time I post a new video. So AMC stock market, guys. So the S&P 500 is now at a death cross. The S&P 500 has been performing very poorly this year and is it now at the scarily low levels but why is this so attractive to investors long term it's because now they're able to acquire long-term investments at a 50 60 some even 70 percent off discount from the peak of the price prior guys so this is a very attractive opportunity to a lot of money to start pouring in the markets very soon that's why i don't think the market is going to push down too much lower guys we did see a little bit push down further on today with the nasdaq coming down two percent s p 500 also in the negative but throughout all that amc still held its own we did dip down to around the high 12s on this morning guys but we quickly shot right back up to 14 and hover, hover right around in that 13 14 dollar area where we've been at for the past six weeks to three months guys so s p i mean uh amc held up pretty well on today through all the ruckus and we is expecting i don't think we will go down no lower than the 13 14 dollar barrier but like i told you guys with the economy with inflation steady rising with the stock market being on edge with a lot of people being in fear that the economy won't be going back to the same with all of this that's going on right now thinking consumers won't be spending as much as they you know were spending prior to all this going on i think not i think consumers are actually spending more during the times like this the stock market is just in fear because of what they believe will happen but it's the but i'm speaking facts on what actually has happened i made a video previously speaking on how people should be more meticulous with their spending and saving more and being you know want to be on a budget being for the fact that things is now at all-time high guys our dollar is losing its value and things is getting more and more expensive by the day that would make people want to spend less all the research all the facts is there for people to spend less at a time like this but people is not understanding people is not giving a damn people are still going on trip people are still buying new cars people are still eating out at nice places people are still spending money at an all-time high like they was before guys from what i see and the people that's around me i don't know about your area i don't know about your people but from what i see and what's going on in my area people is spending 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 guys i don't think they're going to wake up until they wake up and see that bank account getting closer and closer to zero dollars and zero cents with no investments being made so at this time instead of spending all that money in the economy you need to be spending all that money in the stock market because it's going to pay off big time like i was telling uh my, my guy today telling him it's a lot of people that's been in the market for years and years and years and down on their investments you guys know i'm down right now and it's for the new people that just now finding out about the market or getting into the market even if you got family members and stuff don't be uh, a hater and just because you down on your investments don't let them eat off of what's going on because you know you down on 50 percent 60 percent on investments that you thought you bought at a great price at a fair price so if you down that much on a uh, uh, on an investment you bought at a fair price that means your family members your brothers your sisters your people they can get in on that same investment that you down on and they could quickly be up 30 40 percent because you still got to wait to get back 60 percent i'm pretty sure as soon as the market starts to turn around the investments that we down in is going to you know run back up very very quick and sharply guys being for the fact the market has been hammered down so hard and pushed down so severely that the turnaround is going to be epic it's going to be green day after green day after green day after green day and you're going to wish you had so much money involved in the market because everything is going to be going up at the same time simultaneously just as just as it's pulling back everything's crashing down in the red at the same exact time it's going to be running up very hard everything the entire market all sectors will be running all up at the same time simultaneously and you'll be wishing you could have had money here there and there because you can't get it all because you know everything's going to be running together instead of that running first and then that running everything will be running together guys including amc but that's why we say amc is amc has an advantage over everything in the market right now being for the fact that this whole new wave of people investing in stocks 
just because of the you know the, the the attractive price of it like we didn't invest in amc because of the fundamental aspects or because of the economy not spending money in the company no we here for one thing and one thing only for the squeeze and for the squeeze to happen even if that don't happen we done built amc up now to be able to get this company a longevity standpoint and for us to actually invest in the company as a long-term aspect because you got a win-win situation in two ways with amc even if the economy start to crash down and people and consumers don't consume as much as they was before amc is still going to be a breadwinner in that situation because we don't need the economy to spend money in amc amc is going to be attracted to from a lot of people will be pushing their money from the, the the fundamental aspects investments and pushing into amc the reason they'll be doing that is because they see this the regular traditional stock market crashing and right now amc and mean stocks is crashing with it but like i said guys eventually the stock market will calibrate itself and move in the opposite direction if cr crazy crisis in that time frame come that where people is really panicking and the stock market continue to want to push lower and lower then i'm pretty sure amc will take that advantage and be on a different frequency than the stock market because amc is not going to continue to crash and crash if things get scary like that people will run to a stock like amc because they know it still has potential throughout all of this madness and they will be more than likely to liquidate some of their other uh assets and securities that consumers aren't likely to be steady spending money at and invest in something like amc because of the potential two ways so i feel like amc is a win-win situation guys all around the board at this point that doesn't mean throw all your hard-earned money in at it none of that that just means you most definitely want to be invested in it if you involved in the stock market or if you're able to do so guys because the potential massive potential is still there guys it's still there we just got to get through all this bs before we could get to where we're going so you already know guys that's all i got for this video just want to give you guys a quick update on amc let you guys know my thought i love y'all we out and god bless you we come